Hi, I'm BrainFreeze9876, and welcome to part siete of, yes, seven of Roadkill. And... See about those blood and brain stains again. Just mix one part battery acid with six parts fresh acid rain. Apply the stained area... Well, I guess we're gonna do another mission since off. we... Repeat until no stains remain. Since we don't have anything else to do at this time. And we've already gotten all the parts, so... Yeah, the letter sounded more like an infomercial, you know? I don't need an infomercial for this time. <laughs> Alright. Looks like we'll have to make do with three then, won't we? Hang on. Alright, listen. Seems we've got a troublemaker. We had a fourth golfer tonight, but she got knocked around. The gaucho that did it is pumping us out of business. He fucks with us. We fuck! We fuck with him. He has a shipment of booze coming in for his nightclub. I want you to drive over to the club and wait for that shipment to arrive. And when it does, I want you to destroy all of it. Oh, yeah, and one more thing. Drive over to the fun house when you're finished. Uncle Woody wants to meet with you. <laughs> Looks like you're moving up, mate. <laughs> Alright, girls, time to figure out which one of you little trollops gets the party with Uncle Woody tonight. Oh what say you give us a taste then? <laughs> oh, so, we finally get to meet this Uncle Woody person. Oh, come on. You can just stick them right up your ass, cause I don't need them. I'll use my old switchblade, cut me a hoagie, I'm done. You know what I'm saying? Oh, so, man, this is Eva. I could've used this a uh, couple of weeks ago. I can tell you that much. I'm hey, proof it, dude. Well, it looks like someone has decided to crash a party on. Come on. See? See? That sucks. The place sticking on the back seat. Will it still work after a long period of time? That's my next question. Yeah, that's an important question because we all know how hard it is to get sticky hookup pussy. See, man, that's why I hate not having a working Z button. Damn it, that sucks balls. All right, we're gonna try this again. Cause you need a... Actually, actually, I might need a different car for this. But come, I don't want to be doing the shooting. I, it, <laughs> stupid ass driver won't make. See, stupid ass driver won't let you get. He stands up, I say, hey, your letter was two weeks late, our car screwed up, uh, punitive damages, and he says, uh, I didn't know. I well, it looks like someone has decided to crash a party on. Kill him! Go ahead. Yeah, you know, so I was cruising around this Canyon last night looking for some ladies. See? Right? Good yeah. place to do it. But it's funny, you know, I, I'm, I'm always... Stupid. God damn it. I said, hey, big boy. And I said, what do you say, big puss? <laughs> she didn't like that. <laughs> yeah, you know, you gotta talk to him, you know, kind of like that. Alright, time know, for a different you vehicle. On the getaway. I guess the bulldog will do since it's the best combination. But it is Daredevil affiliated, so <laughs> not that I care. Sitting there up there like some big vagina spoiler, totally messing up my top end speed. You know what I mean? Yeah, if I had perfectly working Z button, this mission would be much easier. Not still not easy, but much easier. I couldn't believe it. I mean, a giant vagina was sucking up all the air like a big. Vagina spoiler. I can't drive like that, you know what I mean? So what I do, I hood. I gun down. 
send her ass flying. You gotta go. For this job, I'll let you do the shooting. I know how much fun you had blowing that. Again. Fifty dollar make you holler, and I say, all right, here's fifty bucks, and I go out there and I smack him right in the face. That made you holler, didn't it, dumbass? You could have saved the fifty bucks. Hey, do I take it back? Uh, I don't give it though. I got you. It's a, it's a, you know. It's a Stupid it's fucking Z button. So I roll up to this one, and she says, "Hey, I graduated from Handjob University," and I said, "What? Well, I'm gonna get out of this car, and you can be Magnum Cum Laude." She didn't like that. Well, it looks like someone has decided to crash our party, on Kill him! Again, it's a problem. problem you know? It's not even real, you know? That's why I like dumb hooks. Don't go see this real smart hooks. He wants to use Really, God? Okay. This mission is not realistic. It's really not. I hate it. Stupid effing Z button, though. I hate it, this. And that's a good deal, because you can get peas everywhere. Hell, you could grow a garden in the back and she thought you'd invented money. All right, ladies and gentlemen, you're listening to 96.2 Gear Talk Radio. So do you like my five, 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 gear, or five, For this five, job, five, I'll let you do the shooting. I know how much fun you had blowing the hell out of Wade's shop. <laughs> this wedding is Maybe I can hit it from here. I'm a single mother of three in second location on the neighborhood carpool. Once a month for a week, I pile nine threads into the brain and haul them to and from four different schools slash daycare. Well, it looks like someone has decided to crash our party on! Kill him! Your show is one of the things I'd appreciate any help. And that can God damn it. reading of a thin letter as read by Vinny. That was a good read. Yeah, thank, thank you. You're thank very you. good at that. I can see why you do radio, I tell you that. We interrupt your regularly scheduled programming for the following late breaking news report. Earlier today, violent gunplay was reported in the vicinity of the backdoor nightclub. Onlookers have testified that the deadly squabble was between two rival gangs, the Daredevils and the Gauchos. Two Der Kleinschlanger beer transport trucks were also damaged during the incident. A service will be held tomorrow for the lost beer. May God be with them. News on the hour, on the half, and when we're forced to tell you, I'm Heath McGillivrock. <laughs> uh, Heath McGillivrock. Drop a hammer on the nail every time. I met a two month old once that could put drywall up. The lady's got a lot on her plate, obviously. The Brady is not. Alright, that pissed me off. Know, you know, the Alright, since the pr primer still has a lot of armor, I guess I'll use it for now. Personally, if it were me, I would hide a bolt gun. Since armor really seems to be what you need in this game. As well as a, a small target to hit, too. Although I'm not sure how much that helps. Also, time to get. In case you don't know, the missiles are also up here. Okay. That was close. Actually, what should I do? I spent most of my time effing that mission up, so. <sighs> it'll slow you down. That's the weird thing. You do bad enough, but it'll slow your day down. Yeah. Yeah, you know, a lot of people, you know, they always ask us questions. You know, we get a lot of questions. Number one question we You know, I'm get just going to call like, Actually, nah. You know, what's the best car out there? What should I do? What should I do? Uh, the second one I always get, what car has the best gas mileage? I get that a lot. All the time people ask that. And number three one, of course, is does the car float? I have never seen a car that would float. Well, the bean floats for about two seconds till a catfish takes it under, right? Hmm. Wonder if there's anything new on the map. Ooh, yeah, there's the suicide m or missions, I think. Right? It's so tiny, it's like a bobble, you know? Put some, you know, lunch meat on the bottom of it, and that thing's gone in a minute, you know? So anybody who knows of any secret... Uh, yeah, I actually you know, like these. Deals, you know, if you think that your local car dealership is about to release one or something, by all means, take a Might as well show you this while I'm at it. 
or just tell us about it, call down on a radio show, and don't take... Defend yourself from the suicide bomber. ...with tri-tires on it and shit like that. It's gotta be a real car that people can go and buy a license and insure. That's right, it's gotta be believable. Don't take, you know, the floating stuff you kick down and slap it in a tube on it, you know what I mean? Alright, ladies and gentlemen, we gotta take a quick break. We gotta pay a few bills with a few commercials. Don't touch the dial. We'll be back. Stupid car in the way of, like seriously. Oh my God. We're talking about our dream cars and stuff like that. What what would we do with fifty grand? If if like right now the fifty grand fairy walked in in a g-string and came up and said, "God, you're sexy." Now nah, she wouldn't say that to me. Let's say that she walked in and she just gave us fifty grand. What would we do? And Ben, what would you do? I would first purchase the warrior. All right, for two reasons: speed, and it's an extension of myself. It's it's fat, it's wide, it's long, yet. Not to, uh, you know, cramp, if you know what I mean. Then, what I would do, full stock of Molotov cocktails and a glove compartment. You know, you can never have too many of those. You never know when you're going to need them. Well, the good thing is, is if you don't need them, you can drink them. Okay, good. <laughs> you know, uh, I was thinking about it. I'm sitting here thinking, all right, 50 grand. Come on. That's a lot of money. That's I know you're there. Good cash. That's not like it jingles in your pocket money. That's cash. That's booty on your face money, all right? That's a lot of shit. Holy, huh? I, you know, all right, I, stage I about two. It. Something I've always wanted, even even when I... Uh, I want a rig. To be honest, I'd want huh. a rig. I know wonder if I have enough time to finish this. I'm not gonna be on Probably not, magazine, but I'll rig. tell you how it goes in the next episode. But you know what? Nothing is media than one of those. And then, you know, inside I'd have all the cool stuff. You know, I'd add on, you know, a bad Maybe a fool. I don't know, you know, get the trailer and you put a giant trampoline back there and maybe buy some stuff. And then I get one of those stuff. Shit. The monkeys, and they jump up the how, how did that one. Uh, that one. There was no way I shouldn't have seen that. And I'd have my own traveling monkey basketball stun gun here. And I'd be the only guy to have that. And, you know, I'm telling you about controlling the market. Right there. You know, that's almost a monopoly, so it could end up being illegal. But. With the monkeys in the back to protect them from being stolen because a lot of people steal your trick monkeys. I put a fire on it, right? With cluster rockets and BGM. But I wouldn't put the BGM in the back because some of the monkeys, they get drunk. Because they drink the Molotov cocktails, they get all hopped up on that funny juice. And they stop jumping around because they don't want to work no more. And I had one of the times he grabbed the bolt gun and he lit... Got a organization together. How many people? Basketball. That's weird. I was thinking about, you know, changing the rules of the game, you know, to, you know, kind of keep it fresh for the monkeys. So what I do is I put nine basketballs, and while they're jumping up on the trampoline trying to get this, I throw in one grenade. The monkey that gets the grenade loses. That way we stop this whole monkey dynasty thing. No one gets the ring for five years in a row. Every year you got a new monkey basketball dunk trampoline chain. It's only fake. 96.2 Gear Talk Radio. Feel free to call down anytime. 555-4327. All right, we got a caller on the air. Caller. Hey, check me out. I'm on Gear Talk. What's up, man? All right, check him out. Hey, I'd like to send a shout out to all my friends that are listening. All right, calm down there. Hey, I just want to tell you guys, after you get off work, I'll meet you anywhere. Actually, yeah, I'll reach you for big slips. Really, huh? well, okay. it, uh, yeah, that's why I like it as so much. It gives you actually a decent right, amount of money after okay, a little while. You got a Stanford, and you're telling me that you can beat my blade? Are you stupid? Okay. You have a Stanford. I have a blade. Vinny has a cruiser. Okay, these are classic cars. You got a junk truck. I mean, what do you, what do you got, nitrous or anything? What do you got, some, you have like a thousand people behind you pushing? You got 20,000 horses in front? What do you got? No, that's stupid. Normal Sanford, so you got a normal Sanford and you're calling our radio show telling them that you want to drag race. Are you willing to say right now that you'll drag race for pink ship ownership of the That's car? That's right. You're, you're challenging. Who do you want to race? I'll take both you guys. Um, this guy sounds like a so I'm just coming out of his drive. 
not really, right. pink, you know, if you want to line up and, and race for pink, that's fine with me, but I'm going to tell you this, I'm going to sell your car to an old lady. But as we all know, it's not the car, it's the driver. Me, I've been driving 40 years, never had an accident, never got blown up. I kick ass, I don't get ass kicked. All right, I'll tell you that. And I know Vin over here with his cruiser can smoke anything, right? He's just awesome. Oh, this is going to be easier than I thought. Well, it's going to be real hard for this kid. You know, he's going to lose the first race, and so he's going to have to run the next time. I'll kick the wheels off of my cruiser, and I'll still work your ass. That's right. I'll tell you what. After I'm done racing you, I'll get my mom with a trick coat, and she'll run alongside your Sanford, and she'll be on every time. That was close. I know your mom, she is quick. Alright, kid, that's not funny. You're talking about my mom, and you got a Sanford. Listen, we'll bring your Sanford down to the studio. Hey, where are you from, kid? Yeah, I'm from Lava Falls, man. Yeah, Lava Falls, what's up? Alright, so we got a guy in Lava Falls driving around in the Sanford who wants to race the paint slip. The first listener to go down there, beat him, take his Sanford. Damn it! Bring it down to the studio, win the free... Uh, th that was so effing ridiculous. Oh well. Oh well, that's... At least I get to collect the, all the loot out here afterwards. Oh well, this has been Brain Freeze 9876, and... Yeah, this is the end of the video. Not not bad money, though, at all. But then again, I might just use a cheat to get money from now on. Yeah, that's what I'll do.